anybody who watched 225 saw a great victory for a former pro wrestling superstar in Colby Covington. You experienced uh, some times with him while he was there. You think we'll see him again? And and what do you think of him? Because he he's per- portrays a bit of a, a controversial character in the world of UFC. But uh, what were your experiences like with him? I love Colby. Um, John Hartnett, uh, Dan Lambert, everyone from American Top Team. I think those guys are awesome. Uh, you know, John and Colby came up to me in, in Ottawa. And it, it, days of TV are long and, and, and can be boring. <laughs> you get there early and you spend the whole day there. And they said, hey, let's, you, you, would you mind shooting some stuff with us? And we're going to, you know, try to get Tyrone Woodley upset and all these different things. And, and we did a bunch of videos together. And Colby's always been great. Uh, John's been awesome, and uh, when he got the fight, uh, the rumor of him getting the fight was online, and I tweeted about it, and John immediately sent me a message, and he said the fight's happening, um, it's it's going to happen in Chicago, uh, and, and then they both uh, reached out independently and, and thanked me for everything I did for them uh, to get the fight, and I said, why, you know, I, I was just there with you guys. <laughs> Colby ultimately got the fight. Uh, he's a Eugene, Oregon guy. I'm a big Ducks fan, so so we got along very well. Uh, I text him congratulations. I text him good luck, and, and I've heard back from him, and, and I wish Colby nothing but success. I hope that we get uh, huge, big-money fights with Colby Covington in the future for UFC. He's going to be a star for them. How do you think he transitioned to pro wrestling? Because it seems like he borrowed a lot from that for the UFC as well. As it relates to his uh, personality? Yeah, just, just him as a character within Impact Wrestling and the stuff he did with American Top Team. Well, that's the cool thing about Impact is that, you know, we sort of just like Colby be Colby. I mean, they went out there and, uh, you know, for a while our play-by-play announcer didn't really address any of the guys because I don't think he knew them. Um, but, you know, Colby stood out and, and he, he's a star. And you just saw him in the ring and he's gone to New Jersey and, and did some things out there uh, where he pretended to be uh, Ty Quill and Woodley. It's just funny things and, and that's the kind of guy Colby is. And, and those are the cast of characters that UFC needs going forward. Um, I think they need more people, you you know, UFC in general, I think needs to be more pro wrestling esque in the way that they, uh, they handle their promotions and the way that they handle their characters. There's so many people that they have. um, And Cam will speak to this too. He's a huge MMA fan. Uh, There's so many people that you watch on these shows and they're all kind of, all right, I get this guy, but you, you need profile packages, personality packages, and you need these guys to get out there and do more.